Hi everybody, it's Wanda. I am going to try a different kind of chain pull. Uh, you've never seen me do a chain pull because I only tried a couple of times and I didn't have the right kind of chain. I used a necklace chain, it didn't work very well. So I have put down a very thin base coat and let it all run off as much as possible because I don't want my design to just bury into the white and not show. So I hope I got enough of it off of there. Um, I'm seeing a lot of bubbles. I'm not getting rid of them for some reason. But anyway, so I have some blue down in here with some metallic that I just used in a painting and I have purple that are various shades that was left over from where I did the switch plates a few videos back. So I'm going to try dipping my chain down in there and then just dropping it on and swooping it around and see what happens and it may be a total flop. Wouldn't be the first time I ever had a total flop, but I like to show flops the same as successes because you need to know that not everybody is perfect I'm certainly far from perfect, don't claim to be perfect. Um, I'm not too concerned about trying to be perfect, actually. But um, I do wanna make sure that I get this kind of coated and then get some of it pulled back off. And I have different colors in here. So we will see how this goes. And I have watched a video where a lady did something very similar to this. And right now my brain has completely shut down on her name. But I will post a link to her video. And you all can watch how she did it. Because it came out gorgeous. And I'm just really don't know what I'm doing here. So this should be fun because I have no idea what I'm doing. Hmm, not real happy with that right there. Now, let me wipe off my chain. So far, I'm having fun. I guess that's all that matters. <laughs> Said I'm having fun. I kind of like that one up there, actually. Uh, I don't know if I have enough paint on this chain. That was not good. Hmm. My ends are not coming out good. I don't like the way those ends are working. This may take more practice. It's gonna leave that one like that. Well, not too crazy about this, actually. I saw somebody in my Facebook group the other day say she had an easier time 
if she put her paint, uh, chain down and then put the paint inside the chain. So I'm gonna try that right here. See what happens. She did not post a video for us to watch. So I have no idea. I actually like that little dab left right there. Just a tiny couple of drops there. If my chain hadn't been dirty right there, it would have been better. Hmm. Don't know about this. Too much paint. Still had some paint on my chain. Need a piece of, need something over here to put some water in to wash it off. So I'm not happy with this. Not at all. Not what I was going for. Not that I had a design in my mind. I really didn't, I was just playing, but Hmm, I'm not too crazy about this. I, th I think it could be used to make angel wings. I do think that somehow, or butterflies, much more practice would be needed, that's for sure. Because this is not beautiful at all. <laughs> In my opinion, it's not beautiful. Let's see if I have enough paint on there to do any stretching. Nope, not really. It's going off this edge right in here, maybe. Let's just see what happens. Hmm. Still not loving it. Still not loving it. Okay. Let's play some more then. I have some blue in here that's a really pretty blue, so let's see what we get.
Nope. That ain't pretty. I do like the blue. Of course, it's mixed in with several other colors in this cup because it's a leftover flip cup. Stand up there. Wow. I could see how you could get addicted to this, though. Uh, it's so hard to have control over it. My blue's getting blot out down in there. Hmm. I like the blending of colors, though. Hmm. The blue over the purple looks smashing. Looks beautiful. Oops, I kicked my camera. Okay, I'm gonna stop playing now. I'm sure I did speed this up so y'all wouldn't be bored to death. I'm gonna leave it for now. I may end up pouring over it later. I'm gonna pop my bubbles, wash my chain, um, and give you all a close up. So thank you for watching. So this would be looking at it from the perspective of you during the video. And the part that I love the most is right there. That is just gorgeous. Where that blue came over the top of that purple and blended in, that's beautiful. Some of it went a little too gray towards the end there where my colors were mixing up too much in the cup. So, and right in there. And I took my tweezers and did some little swirls in this area right here but so this is how it blended it was fun it was different i really liked that blue when i first started though it was really pretty should have gone into the main cup of blue which i did not do um still had a little bit of it left in there so that's what i ended up with i'm not sure about this one you all tell me what you think so thanks for watching